Are you sure you want to hear this? Where's it going exactly? As friends, I was just... My heart broke for him. He was really vulnerable. Mm, yeah, he doesn't lead with that. No, but, the, but then a couple days later, I got up in front of the board and, and I just fucking unloaded on them. And I told them that Fred had to be fired and that Corey was the guy to replace him. And I really didn't think I was getting through to them. But then a day later, he came down to my room and he said that they made him CEO. And as his first act, he was lifting my suspension. At that point, he and I were like best friends. And I was a really good friend to him. Anyway, fuck him. You know they're talking about replacing him, right? Wait, what? UBA's in third, which wouldn't be such a big deal if it didn't go hand in hand with scandal. I mean, it doesn't matter that he's had success for them. People's memories are short, and at the end of the day, it just comes down to money. And he's investing just massive amounts in UBA+, Plus, which doesn't launch for another month, and it needs to perform. And, I mean, another streaming service? They should be illegal. I guess you could just not subscribe. At this point, UBA's balance sheet basically looks like a hemophiliac's used Band-Aid. You should talk to him. That's what I'm gonna do. That's how this conversation started. But you should reconcile with him, even if it's just for show. The network is your partner, and he's your CEO for now. Make them your ally, not your foe. Your career will thank you. <laughs>